Hello and welcome to my first ever What I Eat in a Day. I am currently quarantining at my parents' house. I don't have COVID that I know of. I have a cold and my roommate and sister has COVID. I have some minor congestion and a sore throat. That's all. But I'm here because she has COVID. So I'm eating like really weird specific foods. I also don't have that much food because I'm just like, this is not my house. So far this morning, I had some green tea, you know, support the immune system. That's the whole, everything I'm eating is stuff that I'm like, I wanna support my immune system, I wanna reduce inflammation. Normally I would have black tea or coffee, both of which are great options, but I just only have green tea here, so I needed a little bit of caffeine, and that's what we had. And for breakfast, I'm going to have some scrambled eggs with mushrooms. Let's get going. Playing board. I don't know where anything is. Knife and pan. Some people don't like mushrooms. I normally don't eat them very much because my sister slash roommate, the one I already mentioned, she like can't stand the smell of them, so I don't eat them. But I really like them. One issue that I'm having right now, so like I mentioned in my last video that my appetite's been off, but I still don't really have an appetite that I need to make sure I'm eating and supporting my body to get better, because I need it to get better, like ASAP. I need to be thriving. I got mushrooms. Man, I don't feel great. <laughs> so I'm just gonna toss some butter in the pan. And once that's melted, I'll put in my mushrooms. I have to turn on the fan. My parents will murder me if their house smells like mushrooms. Also, they'll watch this video, so they'll know I cooked mushrooms here. <laughs> Otherwise, I could play it off as like, mushrooms? <laughs> Just kidding, I wouldn't lie. I decided to sit outside on the balcony to eat. Mushrooms make eggs look like the least appetizing food in the world. But here we have my breakfast. Mushroom egg scramble, some strawberries, a piece of toast, some green tea, this is my second cup of the day, and water. Warm liquids are easier for me to drink right now. Yeah, my throat's really not feeling its hottest. Still a little too hot for me. Also, it's like 85 degrees out. Something that I think is funny, I've had so much tea in these past few days. Normally in the summer, I don't have hot tea very much, if ever. Third cup of tea of the day. It is now 12.07 p.m. So I'm going with peppermint for this one. Done with caffeine, I had two cups of green tea. But I need to make sure I'm sleeping my best possible sleep ever. No more to caffeine. I also, me being like so focused on getting better right now and being like, I really need to support my body. I feel like, not like to this level of extreme body support, I wanna like not really worry about food too much and I have been doing a better job of doing that. But I feel like overall, this is the vibe I want for my diet. What is gonna make me feel best mentally, physically? I just wanna feel the best I possibly can. And I really wanna support my body, let it do its job. I already do that most of the time, but like right now it's like intense, extreme version. What foods are gonna make me thrive? Cause I just wanna thrive. <laughs> I'm gonna go for a walk. I don't really feel like going for a walk, but I feel like it might help clear out some congestion, so we're trying it. I'm gonna set a timer for 15 minutes and walk away and then turn around. Real easy, just a little quick 30 minutes, get outside, clear out some of this gunk that's in my back of my throat. I really wanna like itch inside of my ear and itch my throat. It's feeling better, like less painful to swallow, so that's good, and I've still been drinking a lot of water. A lot of tea. Let's go. I'm back. I went for about 40 minutes. My timer went off and then I kept going for a little and then I turned around. I stepped in dog poop <laughs> like five minutes in. I wasn't paying attention, I was on the phone with my friends, and then I tripped, and then a mailman saw me trip, and then he said hi, and I said hi, and then was not looking, stepped in poop. I realized as I was getting stuff out for lunch, I didn't really do well at the store. Like, I don't know what I was thinking. Like, I didn't plan meals, which is an issue I typically have. I also wasn't planning on filming this, so like I think I'm just a little embarrassed about what I'm about to show you. I do think that all of the things I'm eating, like I would eat, but just maybe not as a meal. 
I have some frozen blueberries and Harmless Harvest, which is coconut yogurt, it's plain, bone broth, carrots, peanut butter, and flaxseed. So I'm going to mix those four things and then eat some carrots. I have some bone broth. If I'm still hungry, maybe I'll have some peanut butter toast or something. Nothing hits quite as hard as drinking bone broth on a nice 90 degree day. I decided on my walk that one of my goals in life is to have a hydrangea bush. Like a really big hearty one at wherever I live. I think that would be good for me. And I can like make sure it thrives. And I can make sure I thrive. Because <laughs> they're the two things. Just my hydrangea bush and me, that's all I care about. <laughs> Just I care about other things. Mostly those two though. See you when I'm done eating. I like bone broth, but not really in the summer. <sighs> feeling good, feeling full. I actually do feel a lot better, like the walk and this lunch and my sleeping 10 hours last night. Feeling good. Part of the reason why the food options I have are so weird is because I'm not sure if I'm leaving here tomorrow night and go to Iowa on Thursday or if I can't kick this, or if it ends up be actually being COVID, then I need to stay here longer. So like, I didn't get that much stuff. That's the dilemma I'm in. This, what I eat in a day, is not like, I would recommend eating this. This is literally just like what I'm eating today. When I was grocery shopping, I was like, what is the most nutritionally dense foods that I would actually eat? Because I don't want to waste food. So that was my thought process. Cup of tea number four. I just made another cup of tea and I think after this cup of tea I'm gonna go for another walk. Just finish my tea. Time for my second walk of the day. Let's go. I will have one like this. So gorgeous. I love it. I'm back from my walk. It is now 7.01 p.m. My walk was about 50 minutes. Pretty good. And I'm so hungry and I don't have real, like I, I have food. I didn't really plan this well as I already went over. I'm eating some dark chocolate chips. I guess bittersweet is what they're called. They were here. Sorry, mom. <laughs> so I just have some of those. I'm making some toast and I'm gonna have more bone broth and an apple with peanut butter. I might have some more almonds. Feeling a little bit better. I had a dip in the afternoon where I didn't feel as good. My throat still hurts and it like takes effort to swallow every time I swallow. And I'm still congested. Like it's only been a few hours. <laughs> that was the toaster. I don't know why it beeps. Like you can hear it go <laughs> Why does it need to beep? I still don't know when I'm gonna leave for Iowa. So I know I've said I'm gonna bike all the way across Iowa but I'm not sure now. And I'm kind of like I'm pretty sad and stressed. Like, I feel like a little bit of a failure for getting a cold. <laughs> here is my gorgeous dinner. We have peanut butter toast with apples. In here we have almonds and chocolate chips, more bone broth, more water, and I'm definitely gonna eat more peanut butter than what is here. I'm gonna start with the bone broth. I wanna like get this part done because the rest of it's sweet. And that's what I really want. I like this, like it tastes like chicken noodle soup. Like what's there not to like? I ate all of the food here you can see. <laughs> uh, this jar, let me just defend myself. It, it was here when I got here. I didn't like open this. I bought other peanut butter because I didn't realize there was some here. But it was like almost empty and now it's like really almost empty. I'll definitely finish it tomorrow. I do eat a concerning amount of peanut butter. I'm pretty full. I don't think I'm going to be leaving the house again because it's 7.50 and I gotta get ready for bed soon. <laughs> I had been feeling like I needed to sneeze all afternoon. Like I sneezed a bunch all morning and then from like 2 until I literally was eating I felt like I needed to sneeze and then I finally did as I had food in my mouth, which was not good, but that's, at least I sneezed. 
that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you don't eat what I just ate in a day. Unless you really want to. Like, maybe maybe see how I feel. See what my diet's like. It's, it's not great. I've watched other what I eat today's. And they all make, like, full meals. And that's just not me at this point today. Like, I do that sometimes. But not today. So that's that's what you got if you enjoyed watching this or if you have a friend that has a cold feel free to share it with them if you want to subscribe that would be cool if you want to like this video i'd love that please by all means like it thanks for joining me today this was good for me to have you with me it was fun you know like with a friend all right that's it <laughs> thanks again for watching goodbye good night